What's up, you guys? This is Karmic and Dean's 1010, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangels, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel these current ancestor messages for the collective. Ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys. For all the love and the support you show to me on the channel, I appreciate you. Alright, and all of the other information about me with the other platforms I am on will be down in the description box below with the links available. Alright? Alright you guys, so let's see what's going on. Let's see what the ancestors want you to know at this time. What do you want the collective to know, spirit? Ancestors. Okay. We got Aunt Caroline. Okay. So for some of y'all, this could be an aunt. Okay, that's in your energy at this time. That could have passed away. This person is going to help you get a victory in a situation. Okay. Yeah, so someone is, this person is going to help you get a victory here. Yeah, Ace of Swords. Yeah. For some of you guys, you're going to be going alone in a situation. Okay? To do something, like you're going to be led to do something by yourself. Yep, is what I'm seeing for some of y'all. You're going to be led to go somewhere by yourself or something, is what I'm hearing. Yep. Three of Wands. Yep, you're going to be led to go somewhere. Yeah, Four of Pentacles. Something about a train or taking a train or something about a train can be significant. Okay? But it's like, yeah. You're going to get some clarity in a situation. So for some of you guys, it's like you could have been back and forth about a situation. But whoever this aunt was that passed away, this person is going to help you get, give you some kind of clarity on what path you need to choose in a situation. Okay? For some of y'all, this could have something to do with business. Okay? Or this is a person. All right? But whoever this person is, this person, this aunt, this person is going to help give you some kind of victory, some kind of clarity or something like that. When it comes to a situation to help you move forward. Okay. All right. Ancestors. Let's see. What are the messages? Ancestors. All right, remember who you are, okay? Balance yourself. Shine brightly. Yeah, bottom of the deck, we have connect with animals. One more. Yeah, medicine bag, treasure. Bottom of the deck, we have altar. Okay, so for some of you guys... This is whatever your ancestors is going to be giving you a victory in, or I'm hearing wherever your ancestors are leading you to go, this is a part of honoring your ancestors. Okay, is what I'm seeing here. Yep, for some of you guys, you're, you're going to be led to some treasure. Okay, so it's like your ancestors are going to lead you to like some treasure in a situation. Because I'm hearing a lot of you guys, you're going through another stage in life, okay, where you may be called to stand out a little bit more, okay, is what I'm hearing. Or I'm hearing get back out there. So for some of you guys, this could be like you getting back out there and your ancestors want you to be fearless and strong, okay? So your ancestors want you to be fearless and strong and shine brightly here. Okay. All right. What else, Spirit? What 
what else? Yeah, bring love into the situation. All right, hermit. What else? Feel loved and comfort. What else, spirit? Yeah, release the old and rest. Surround yourself with protective energy. Okay? So for some of you guys, you are led to bring love into the into a situation and retreat and recharge here. So what situation do you need to bring love in? Let's see. What situation do the collective need to bring love in? What's the situation about? Okay. Your investments. Okay, yeah. So it's like, for some of you guys, it's like your ancestors want you to pour more into your investments. Okay, is what I'm feeling. Because you're going to have a victory. Yeah, you're going to be very stable. For some of y'all, this is with your lover too. This is with your lover. Okay? So it's like, yeah, keep pouring into your investments at this time. Something to do with Aquarius or Capricorn or Taurus. Virgo. Okay? Make sure you are retreating and recharging your energy. For some of you guys, you may be led to meditate or meditate more. Okay? Do that is what I'm hearing. Yep, do that. Okay, if that's what you're being led to do. Because that's also a part of honoring your ancestors. Okay, so remember, not the only way to honor your ancestors is not only through labor and work. It's also other things as well, you know, with honoring your ancestors, okay? All right. So your ancestors want you to, like, release old, release old ways of thinking, releasing old people, releasing old habits, okay, in a situation, yeah. So your energy could get, like, balanced out the way it should, all right? That's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing by the fall, things could be like a total switch around for you if you do it right. Yeah, you could be sitting real good, okay? I'm hearing like believe in the impossible. King of Pentacles is like, like, shit, like millionaire energy. You know, very, very, very stable, you know, very sitting, you know, real the fuck good, Okay? So it's like whatever you are led to pour love into, do that because that's a great investment. And it's it's only going to lead you to riches and peace is what I'm hearing. That's, I mean, it, it, that's the only, it's just going to lead you there. Okay. Ancestors for the Akashic Tarot. Let's get into the Akashic Tarot. Yeah, the art of the coven and encrusted moon. Exactly. Archangel Gabriel. You're going to be receiving a lot of downloads and messages as well when it comes to your investments or what do you need to invest in. For a lot of you guys, you're going to be getting downloads. So do not ignore these downloads that you're receiving at this time. Yeah, initiation. So for some of you guys, you are being, you are, it's like, you're going through a very high, uh, ascension for some of y'all it's, it's some shit yo and for a lot of y'all it's like man you just don't understand the power that you about to have yo it's gonna be unfucking real it's gonna be unfucking real yo whatever this is that you pouring love into it's like you gonna be like the a motherfucking beast with this shit yo and you gonna get a lot of love for it too like <laughs> And anybody that try to do some bullshit, they gonna get caught up. It's like you about to have some kind of power that's just, it's gonna be like unreal. Like I'm just really feeling that energy. Like really some supernatural kind of shit, okay? <laughs> okay? 
That's what I'm seeing here. June 6th, June 11th, June 14th, November 11th, November 6th, November 14th. Give me a uh, spirit animals. Give me a spirit animal. Somebody could be a life path number 11. Life path number 6. Life path number 5. I heard life path number 7. Alright. Spirituality. We have Hulk. Fly above and beyond your day-to-day -day thoughts to observe them from a bird's eye view. Quieting the mind and detaching from your thought patterns puts you in a better position to take in messages from your spirit guides. Yeah, it's like you you guys are really being led to like really like meditate and get in tune. Because it's like you're gonna like really figure some shit out, like even like about yourself, like and how powerful you are and shit. Productivity. It is time to examine your productivity. Disorganization and indecisiveness may be causing you to miss opportunities. Take a moment to prioritize your goals and get a clear view of how to get where you want to go and what it will take to get you there. All right. So for some of you guys, you are like called to like step back in a situation only if you're feeling a little bit confused. Okay, I mean, if you if you feeling like, you know, things is flowing, of course, that's not for you. But that's only if you feeling like confused in a situation. It may be time for you to step back and really examine your situation and really just be real with yourself about what really is going on. Okay. All right. That's some good energy, you guys. Yeah fake as fuck okay so for some of y'all if you got a fake person in your energy you're gonna realize about that okay you're gonna realize about a fake person here somebody could work in the beauty industry okay in some shape or form makeup artists nails lashes eyebrows okay So you guys are going to get a lot of strong clarity. I mean, your ancestors, somebody ancestors is really trying to get to them. Like, really trying to get them some kind of message. Okay. We have C. Something to do with a Virgo could be significant. All right, energy. All right, energy. Something to do with a Ford. Somebody could drive a Ford. All right, something to do with Y. And we have N. Community service. Right leg and our thigh tattoos. Chest tattoo. Factory worker, beauty industry, love and or romantic movies, that earth sign a hater, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Q, convertible, some do a gap teeth. Backfire is on the way. So whoever this fake motherfucker was, backfire is on the way. F, we have bald head. Black magic was put on your work. We have chains. Some will do a W. We have body sprays. Joggers. No kids. Some will do it a Virgo. S. Some will do a thicky. Somebody could be real thick or like plus size. We got tongue piercing. We got F. Somebody could love heels or love when somebody wear heels. B. Dancer. Some do it a Leo or eight could be significant. We have manager. Best sex or love with a fire sign. 
Aries Leo Sag. We have Watch. Long curly hair, real or fake. Yeah, whoever this uh fake person is, they could have been on some bullshit in a situation. Okay, for some of y'all, this could be somebody you invested in before. Whether this was love or not, somebody could have been on some bullshit. But whatever this is that you are led to put love into, this is not bullshit. Okay, is what I'm seeing here. This is not bullshit. Okay, something with 89 or 98. Okay, some something with wrestling. Somebody could love wrestling or something with a wrestler. Okay. What else, Spirit? All right, you guys. Something with bow ties. Somebody could wear bow ties. Okay. All right, so we have Boss. I mean, period. Oh, I thought this... No, that was... That's not an O, but I was... I was feeling Boss energy. Even though that's not an O, I mean, shit. <laughs> it's still giving me that kind of vibe. Okay? So whatever this is, what you led to pour into, it's going to turn you into a boss. For real, for real. All right? If this is like a person, this person is going to upgrade you some kind of way. That's This person going to increase you some kind of way. That's going to make you even more of a boss. If you a boss now... This person going to come in and increase you even more. Okay? Is what I'm seeing. Something to do with a barbecue. Alright? Or something like that. I heard Sequita. Sequence. Quincy. Alright? Something to do with Christopher or Chris. Alright? Somebody could be biracial. Alright? Something to do with Southwest. Southwest. What else, Spirit? Our Sunita, Sharon. Something with Cyrene. Okay. Something about, like, I'm hearing sci-fi, okay? Something to do with sci-fi, okay? I heard right, W-R-I-G-H-T, or white, W-H-I-T-E. That could be somebody's last name or whatever. All right, I heard Sophia. I heard Siberia. All right. I heard Cynthia. I heard Belina. Something to do with Belina. All right. All right, you guys. I really hope that these messages helped you. Or gave you some kind of clarity in your situation. I, okay, I heard North Carolina just now. Something to do with North Carolina. Okay. Any other messages? I heard Constance or Connie. Constance or Connie. All right. I heard Colleen, Colleen. Okay. All right, you guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. Also, I heard a bow and arrow. Something to do with a bow and arrow. Somebody can learn that, know how to do it, or whatever. Okay. Something about sequence. 
like a sequence dress or something like that sequence okay that could be somebody name even okay all right you guys look in the description box below for any other information about me and until next time peace